Hello students, in today's class we are going to calculate degree of freedom of the given mechanism. So, चलिए सबसे पहले हम लोग numbering कर लेते हैं. जो fix link है, उसकी numbering हम सबसे पहले करते हैं, उसे हम लोग link number one देते हैं. So, this fix link and this fix link we will take as link number one. This slider, we take this slider as link number two. This particular, uh, this particular link is a whole link. So this link is link number three. This link is link number four. And here is a joint between these two links. This is link number five. This is link number six. This is link number seven. And this is link number eight. So total number of links in this question is L is equal to eight. Now we will try to find out number of binary joints. So uh, between 1 and 2, fixed link 1 and slider link 2, we are having one binary joint. Between link number 3 and link number 2, there is a pin joint. This is also a binary joint. Link number 1 and link number 4, between these two links, we will have one binary joint. Between link number 3 and link number 4, we are have one binary joint. Between link number 3 and link number 6, we will have one binary joint. Between link number 4 and link number 5, we will have one binary joint. Between link number 5 and link number 6, we will have one binary joint. Between link number 5 and link number 7, one binary joint. And between link number 6 and link number 8, we will have one binary joint. And last, between link number 7 and link number 8, we will have one binary joint. So now we will calculate how many binary joints are there in this particular mechanism. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 and 10. So here in this mechanism, total number of binary joints are 10. Now number of higher pairs. So here uh, in any links, in any two links, there is no line contact or point contact. So in this particular mechanism, there is no higher pair. So number of higher pair will be taken as zero. So now we will be able to find out degree of freedom. Degree of freedom will be 3 into L minus 1, L is 8 minus 1 minus 2J, 2 into J that is 10 minus H higher pair that is zero. So we will get 7, 3 are 21 minus 20 that is equal to 1. So in this question, we are getting degree of freedom as 1. So that's all in today's class. Thank you.